Professor at Boehner and the Managing Director for Latin America. Hi, I'm Wanda Pogue. I'm the Chief Strategy Officer um, globally at Boehner. I think at Boehner Media, We've been on this journey for the last 15 years to help brands be relevant. We started as a community management agency really rooted in social media. And over the last 15 years, we built the company into 13 different office locations, hired incredible people, and we get to do these big things like this. We've won plenty of can lions. We've done all of the sort of big important things that advertising agencies are supposed to do. But what differentiates Vayner is our commitment to driving relevance through where people are actually paying attention. And you know, 15 years later, here we are still very much focused on social media as an insights engine, as a brand builder, as a relevance driver, as a sales driver. And we've stayed true to that mission and kind of done it our way. Vayner's an independent agency, um, one of the biggest independent agencies that exists. And we're anchored in this focus on really day trading attention, um, which is Gary's philosophy. So still doing a lot of things our way, uh, which is really fun to sort of see the progress and the growth and the incredible brands we're lucky to partner with all across the world and uh, especially in Latin America, which is our sort of one of our newest markets. I think we have a very unique approach that also differentiates us from, you know, most advertising agencies, if not all advertising agencies. We take a very consumer up, consumer led approach. So everything for us starts with the consumer. You know, we refer to them as cohorts. So we believe in driving relevance at scale and that brands today need to be relevant to more people on more things. So for any campaign, um, we normally have about 30 different cohorts, consumer groups, consumer audiences, and we create for them. We create and based on what's, what's you know, really gaining traction, then from the little idea, we find the big idea. AI was the talk of the town last year in Can Lion, and this year is no different. I think the conversation has progressed, though, because you know AI has sort of been quietly building in the background of digital media and marketing for the last 20 years. If you think about the algorithms that power your favorite social media apps, those are all based on AI. When ChatGPT sort of came onto the scene, that really woke consumers up to the power of generative AI and then subsequently the brands. And last year it was like, the robots are going to take over our jobs. This year, the conversation is a little bit more subdued. I think brands realize the transformational power that generative AI can have for efficiency, uh, but we haven't yet cracked the, the code on how to do that in ethical um, and legally compliant way. I think we're doing a lot, we're seeing a lot of, you know, asset optimization, resizing, you know, what I might call like churn work or, or things like that that help increase like various um, variables, but we're not yet seeing um, brands who are, you know, fully able to, to take the hands off the wheel because I think the essence of creativity is still so human led. We actually had some very interesting panels here this week, including a few influencers who were talking. Some were very into it, some were very like not into it. And I think the jury is still out on exactly how we're going to be able to meaningfully integrate generative AI um, to sort of transform our marketing landscape. But we're absolutely chipping away one step at a time.